Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time we were working a lot on the social links. Uh, we learned a little bit about the supposed ghost of Gekukan High. And uh, we're trying to unravel that mystery there. We also finished uh, Bunkichi, like the old couple, uh, Bunkichi and Mitsuko's. Uh, uh, what is it? their social ranks and got like the max and the hierophant and we were working on uh maiko and um forgot the other kid's name the one that sent to his high school teacher so we are also on the cusp of the uh full moon which means we're potentially gonna be hitting another boss battle Until then, what are we today? Friday, so today is Courage. We also worked on a lot of these um, computer things, the computer stuff. So I think I'll wait on these on like more dead days. Uh, what is today? Yeah, let's go work on our Courage, why not? Oh. Uh, I wanted to check... Oh, that is not what I wanted. Sorry, I've got to get used to the controls again. It's been a little while since I played. Spend time with Mutatsu. Mutatsu? Uh, if I remember correctly, Mutatsu is someone we have not met yet. He should be an escapade here. Never mind. Uh, we probably miss like a chance to meet him. He may come on certain certain day to like meet him. But anyways, go to the arcade. Uh, courage, yeah. Yes, so we can fast forward through this. Hey, look at that, we leveled up our courage. We are now determined. We're now three in all stats, which is good. Making good, very good progress. I have to remember that I have plans tonight. I forgot what those plans were. Probably something to do with, um, with the C's group. What Junpei says. Seriously? Dude, Yukatan is taking this way too seriously. Why did I open my big mouth? You're the one that gets excited for this kind of stuff. Oh! Oh, hey, Yukikun. Don't forget about today, okay? Alright. Uh, so Chihiro, Chubby Student, and Maiko. So, let's go with Maiko. What's up, little one? Uh-oh. Not a good sign. I... I... Feel as if we can... I feel as if we can go closer. Alright, let's do it. Don't worry, Maiko. We'll get some takoyaki. Make everything better. I... I don't know what to do! <laughs> My dad! <laughs> I should sit with her until she calms down. Oh shit. He hit me. <laughs> He's so mean. It's not fair. That why would he do that? He didn't do anything wrong. Michael looks de dejected. All I did was ask why they're getting a divorce. He got mad at me and 
said to stay out of it. So I kept asking, but Dad yelled at me and... and he hit me. Then Mom said it was my fault for asking so much. I don't know if they love me anymore. Do they just wish I would disappear? No, they would never. Even the moms, like, oh, it's your fault. That's fucked up, man. Never. But then, why do they get so mad? What if I ran away from home? I want to know how they really feel about me. If they love me, they'll try to find me, right? <sighs> it's a secret, okay? Don't tell mom and dad I'm running away. I know you won't tell. My ego seems to trust me a lot. Uh... I... I don't know if I'm with this plan, kid. Now. Let's play again sometime. Uh... I... <laughs> No. All right, it's time. Let's get going. <laughs> Shouldn't we talk about this some more? I still think this is a bad idea. How are you scared of ghosts, but totally All right. fine with this? We were gonna go in the back alley and um, talk to some of those uh, those thugs that are potentially behind all this. Yeah, yeah. Cause stuff you can't see is way creepier. Actually, I'm more worried about the things I can see. Like bats and knives. <laughs> Big deal. So it's a little dangerous. Come on, let's strike while the iron's hot. Strike? Yep, strike hard. You're actually excited about this? We should try gathering information at the outskirts of the station. Hey, we're going on a field Yo. trip. Do you want to come along? You guys are going out at this hour? I don't know what you're up to, but just avoid going anywhere dangerous. Why wouldn't we all go together? You know, safety numbers and all that, especially with Akihiko. Precisely. All three of you are heading out together. Take care not to get injured. Let's see what TV hey, says. Listen. Go watch TV after we get back. Let's go. Oh, it's the dream team. Sheesh, you guys are always together. What's up? Hold on, you're not really going to Port Island Station right now, are you? Haven't you heard the reports? It's super unsafe. Yeah, that's why we're going. The hell you kids doing out here this late? You delinquents keep loitering in the wrong places, getting up to God knows what. The Chevier gang wears the heavy clothes, covers tattoos. Tell him I got my eye on him. Now scram. <laughs> I'll call the cops. Wait, seriously? Man, going to a place like that this late at night, it's not so easy for a stand-up guy like me. Yeah, right. Jeez. Would you stop complaining already? It'll be nothing. All we have to do is take the monorail to the station. What's so hard about that? No way. That's not exactly what I meant by not easy. You know, Yukatan, you might actually be scarier than the punks we're bound to run into. That don't look so bad. The hell are these guys? Check out those rags. They're from Gecko High. Oh man, this is even worse than I thought. You must have taken a wrong turn. Cause this place ain't for you, buddy. Uh, well, I. What I'm saying is. You being here is ruining our vibe. Beat it, goatee. Huh. Goatee? Oh, <laughs> you mean me. We don't need your permission to be here. Hey, are you nuts? You read the room, won't you? I can read just fine. Come on, don't be intimidated by these punks. 
What'd you just say? She just called us punks. Come on, let's post some pictures that'll make her daddy cry. Hope you've been practicing your sexy poses. <laughs> oh boy, that's too good. Yeah, good one. These guys are scum. Oh, so now we're scum, huh? Man, I feel sorry for you, goatee. This bitch is a real pain in the ass, isn't she? Jinpei! <laughs> That's enough. They didn't know what they were getting into. I'll make sure they leave. You good with that? Who do you think you are, dumbass? They're not walking out of this. You want some too? It'll be fine. Oh shit. Uh, shit! Son of a bitch! You just crossed the line. You think you're going home alive now? Should we find out? Uh No? Or maybe not. <laughs> oh man. What a loser. Bastard. Your name's Aragaki, right? Yeah. Now I remember. Shinjiro Aragaki. You're from Gecko High, too, aren't you? Damn it, you're gonna regret this! <laughs> oh man, Senpai! That was awesome! I remember you. You guys were in Aki's room at the hospital. You idiots. Go home. You don't belong here. Wait! It'll be fine. Sorry, but there's something we need to know before we leave. Did Aki tell you to come here? No, he didn't. <laughs> well, what do you want to know? Is this about that ghost story? <laughs> yes, that's right! How'd you know? The rumor's been going around. Those girls who wound up in the hospital were here talking shit every night. They'd brag about all the stuff they did to some girl named Yamagishi. Yamagishi? You mean Fuka Yamagishi from 2E? They were picking on her? That's why people are saying it's Yamagishi's ghost that did it. Yamagishi-san's ghost? Wait, what do you mean by that? You guys don't know? This Yamagishi girl might be dead. I heard she hasn't been home in over a week. Wait, what? I thought she was just out recovering. So, you mean she's still missing? So much for that ghost story. Mr. Akota is the homeroom teacher for 2E, right? Does he know about this? I get it, Aki. So trying to make up for the past. Hmm. It's you who can't let go. Huh? Nothing. Anyways, that's all I know. We done here? Yeah, totally. Thanks a lot. Come on, show some appreciation. <laughs> Thanks. I didn't do nothing. Thank you for helping us and for sharing what you know. That was really nice of you. Huh? Oh, uh, sorry. Just don't come here again. <sighs> so, interesting. Uh, the girl might be dead after all. Who knows what's going on? Dude, I'm drenched in cold sweat. But man, what Aragaki san told us was shocking, huh? I like Kirijo Senpai know what we found out about Yamagishi san. The fact that she's missing is no small matter. Man, we're totally gonna get yelled at for doing that without permission. Can already see it happening. Yeah, I don't know why you guys just didn't say what you were gonna do. Give me a break. Seriously, going to a place like that, there are limits to how reckless you can be. I mean, I'm proud of you guys for trying to gather information, but 
be a little more careful next time. Hmm. Yamagishi has disappeared. It began with a ghost story, but has developed into a serious situation. We have to do something. Today's exchange rate. The end is now 115.12 to the dollar. Down last time by 0.11 yen. Again, I, I don't know how much that is in relation. <sighs> I told you it wasn't a good idea to go there, dude. If aragaki son hadn't helped us, who knows what would have happened to us. Ugh, I'm getting an ulcer just thinking about it. <sighs> I said I was sorry. I didn't think it would be that bad. <sighs> well, now you know. Next time, have a little more faith in what I say. Anyways, there's no way in hell I'll ever uh, set... I'll, oh, I'm ever setting foot in that place again. You say that now. Hey. That guy actually looked kind of scary, but he was actually really nice, don't you think? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Well, you can't judge a book by its cover and all that. But what was he doing at that place? Saving our ass. You just said it. So Saturday, it's academics today. Uh, I think I'll we'll do this. We'll do one of the computer ones. Uh, requires courage to defeat zombies through typing. I'm guessing this one's gonna raise our HP since the other one raised our SP, the mind, the mental one, the mental boot camp. So might as well. Muscle boot camp. It seems that it seems to be educational software that teaches you about muscles. In this short session, you'll learn 600 ways to use your muscles. An immense amount of information is being presented at a rapid pace. Congratulations, you are hereby promoted to Muscle Sergeant. I sure learned a lot about how to use my muscles. I feel like I have more stamina now that I've watched this. By seven, I will take it. No school today. It's almost time for the home shopping show. Yeah, let's see what's what's good. It's amazing commodities. I'm going to do it. I, I, I'm going. I'm going to do it. Don't stop me. You're concerned about your personal appearance. This is something you must have on you. Good, good. First, we'll have the perfume. This luxurious fragrance will change your life. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait. There's more. Not bad, kid. We'll throw in this health supplement, too. Guess how many? Two. All this for just 39... 3,980 yet. Uh... Sure. Thanks, kid. Thanks, kid. Next time, we'll be introducing a Father's Day campaign. Don't miss it. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. So we do that or Bunkichi. We'll do Maya. That's fine. Uh. Yeah. All right. We're leveling up. I think I'll spend a day playing games. How's that sound? I see Maya. Whoa, did you just get here? We signed on at the same time. The weather's nice outside today, huh? Let's go outside. In game, duh. Tristo. Shinagawa. A gray colored sky stretches as far as the eye can see. A barren wasteland lies before Tatsuya and Maya. Maya stretching. For an apocalypse, the air sure is nice out here. Yeah, right. It's just a game. We should go level or something. I'm so lazy in real life, Tatsu. I haven't even gotten dressed or put on makeup. It's Sunday, you don't gotta do shit. Maya stands at attention. Ah, I'm so fucking pissed off right now. Mr. E is such a stupid a SOB. Uh, do you mean SOB? Who's mystery?
Tatsuya, you know too much now. I shouldn't have mentioned his name, huh? Ha 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 ha, Ruffle Mile. I don't get me busted, okay? Maya seems happy. Maya's looking around. Um, there aren't that many players anymore. Most of them left for that new MMO, COW. Call of Warfare? Uh, there are a lot of dupers and gold farmers, but still. It's good, though. It uh, lets us talk about personal things, right? Maya is a shy girl, you know. Plush, lol. See, Mr. E is a teacher. It was kind of above me. Oh, no. So you can't figure out what my job is, can you? Uh... Are you a teacher? Yeah, you're smart. I knew you'd figure it out. You got an A-plus for reading comprehension today. Lol. Maya seems happy. Well, now you know I'm a teacher. Hey, I just figured something out. When I complain to you, I feel better afterwards. From now on, we have to party up together. Okay? Promise. Seems Maya feels comfortable talking to me about real life. I feel like we're growing closer. A teacher, eh? Wonder who she could be. I'm so pumped. I think I'll clean the bathroom. It's been two months. Ugh. Maya's player signed off. Maya signed back on. Don't tell anyone about the SOB stuff, okay? It's our little secret. Maya's player signed off. I decided to log out as well. Who could she be? Or he, we don't know. I mean, Maya's only a character online. Could be a guy playing. Hmm. Oh, it's you. Yuki, could you free up your day tomorrow for me? There's a lot to be done for Fuko Yamagishi's case. So I'm going to require your assistance. Please. If you have any urgent affairs, then I suggest you settle them by the end of today. <laughs> so mind your own biz. All right, let's go to Polonia. Let's go to the police station here. <sighs> Number of people infected by apathy syndrome seem to be increasing. Thought it would decrease, but I guess that's just wishful thinking. We could be in for the long haul, so feel free to get prepped here. Well, let uh, be. Did we buy need. stuff last time? Yeah, it looks like we did buy stuff. I think it was just the armor and footwear we didn't really buy. Or just the armor. I think we did well, buy footwear. Be. As long as you need. Yeah. Uh huh. What are you looking for? Nine thousand. I have no idea what you're fighting out there. Just don't get in over. Huh? Made up you know, your mind? I'll buy two. Great. It's all yours. Clip. Um, Everything look good here? Great. It's all yours. You gotta tell no yeah, sell it. What um, and I don't you think need? I want any accessories. Hmm? You finished? What do you got? Uh, yeah, How many are you standing? All right. How many? All right. I'll take that. I'll keep this stuff for now. All done here? I'm Let's all done. Yeah. Okay, so Sunday, today, I think it's just raising up Persona stats. Uh, persona strength, agility, and magic, yeah. Let's do some karaoke. Raise our courage a little bit. Never mind. 
Um, let's see if we can find that other social link here. Because it is Sunday. No. It's a guy that normally sits here. Maybe... Maybe somewhere else? What do other people do today? Tatsu. So some people went to Tartarus. Everyone's average level is 19. What's our level? Uh, where's the Sarah level? Oh, there we go. 17. And we could go to Tartarus. Actually, we haven't checked the uh, the side missions for uh, Elizabeth in a little while. Let's see if there's anything new. Oh shit! Marvelous. I mean, I'll take this I'm twilight forward fragments. To it. How may I assist you? Uh, talk, I guess. No. How may I assist you? Leave. We look for. Good day. Uh, about requests. Here are my requests. So shadow hunting, treasure hunting. Where are we on this? About halfway, more than halfway. The Big Eater Challenge. We could try that. Do you see anything achievable? And the Umi Ushi Beef Bowl. We can do that stuff now. Very well. So let's head to the Net Cafe first. See if there's anything new there. I don't remember if I checked last time. Come on. Nope, Come everything's on. gone. Uh, Welcome. See, so remember, we have member-only dishes. Check them out. Website said only members can order takeout. Staple the Umiji Restores, 20 HP to one ally, heats up when eaten, increases all, all stats of ally for three turns. I'll just buy one. Thank you. Yep, yeah, it's closed. It's too crowded. Katsu Kitchen. Smarter when you digest. In here might help with ac academics. Really? In order to the prodigy platter rich in omega 3 is to help raise your academics. Time will pass if you eat here. If you come by on certain nights, there may be new items on the menu that aren't normally available. Uh, not now. Alright, let's try this wild duck challenge. 1000 yen, the green star, secret. Eating the burger might help me gain more courage. My time only. Wild duck burger big eater challenge is underway. 1800 yen. Uh, sure. Why not? Let's try it out. <clears throat> is that Batman? Looks like Batman on the on the menu on the table. Wow, that's a lot of burgers. This is a ridiculous amount of burgers. I wonder if I'll be able to finish everything. So from what we can see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 burgers. It's a lot of burgers. Can you imagine McDonald's had that? And 1,800 yen, that's what, like 10, 15 bucks? 12 burgers for 15 bucks. No matter how much I eat, the amount of burgers doesn't seem to decrease. Um, focus on a single burger. 
Set of flavor each bite only brings more pain. I don't think I could finish everything. I couldn't eat it all. I have to try again some other time. Oh, two. Okay. Although I couldn't finish it, I feel like I've grown just by taking the challenge. Okay. So it's probably something we'll have to just keep on doing. Yo. What's up? We're supposed to gather in front of the faculty office during lunch. Uh, what's this about? Hello there. Uh, dude, you serious? We're supposed to ask about Fukuyama Gishi, remember? But asking Mr. Ikota for an explanation sounds like a total pain in the ass. This is so lame, especially when compared to what we to when we went to that spot behind the station at night. You mean last night? Or two nights ago, rather? Oh, Kirijo Senpai. Why are you here? Same reason you are. Mr. Ikota, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. I never thought it'd turn out this way, Uka. Hey, I remember you. What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Kiri Jokun. This isn't an interrogation. Stop scaring her. Moriyama, you don't have to say anything if you don't want to. You wouldn't want to give her the wrong idea. Uka, she. she always looked so frazzled whenever I gave her a hard time. That's when I realized. She may be a model student, but deep down, she's just like us. And because of that, I knew exactly which buttons to push. We were just messing with her earlier that day, too. It was May 29th. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. Wait, what? You trapped her inside? That's messed up. That night, Maki got worried Fuka might commit suicide, so she went back to the school by herself, but she never came back. And the next morning, she was found lying outside the front gate. I went to the gym to let Fuka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her, but every night, Another one of us wouldn't come back. And then they all ended up like Maki. I see. Mr. Okoda, all this time you've been reporting Yamagishi is absent due to illness. But the truth of the matter is that she was missing. You had to have known this. Explain yourself. I was thinking of the students, of course. You children getting a may teacher? not understand, but we have to consider the future of everyone affected. So you chose not to report a missing child for the good of the class, and not because you didn't want the police involved. It... it was in her best interest. I wouldn't want her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agreed. So to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. Despicable. Despi... no! I... I... I didn't mean, uh, I, I was just... That's enough. You can go now. We'll handle the rest. Can you imagine Wait, if you talk to a teacher what? this way? Don't worry. This won't be the last you'll hear of this. Oof. About your friends. Did you notice anything unusual about them before they went missing? Anything at all? <sighs> A voice. A creepy voice. They all mentioned it right before they went missing. They said they could hear it, calling their name. Oh, man. Senpai, could it be? It's them. No doubt about it. Up until now, we've never been able to predict who exactly would become aware during the dark hour. This voice must be the key. In other words, it doesn't just happen randomly. They actually get drawn in. I realize now, after seeing all of this, they're clearly targeting humans. Shadows are most definitely the enemy of mankind. Stay at our dorm tonight. 
That should be the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave your room no matter what happens. If you can manage that, you should be fine. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be all right as well. Uka. Yo. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. Sorry, what did you say? Iori and Takeba oh. too. So me, Yori, and Takabo. We'll meet at the after school in the student council to discuss tonight's operation. Tonight? Yes. We are going to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. If my guess is right, she's still inside the school. Understood. How messed up is that? Good. You're all here. Like, how messed up is it that, like, She's been missing for a week. That means she's been stuck inside Tartarus for a week. And I know they said, like, time kind of works differently, but still, men could be five minutes, could have been five months. Who knows, right? Tonight, we're infiltrating the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Uh, I don't get it. Are you saying Yamagishi is inside the school somewhere? And why are we doing this at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Exactly. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Wait! You mean Yamagishi-san's been over there ever since she got locked in the gym? That's right. But that was ten days ago! No matter how you look at it, she's gotta be... Don't lose hope just yet. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So where does it go for the rest of the day? Nobody knows. That's a good point. This is just a theory. But I think time flows differently in Tartarus. So even though it's been 10 days for us, it could have only been 10 hours for her. There's a chance she's still alive. Yeah, 10 hours. But like I said, could have been 10 months, could have been 10 years. Come back. Uh, we, we find Fuka, she's got like a long Gandalf beard. Wow, you think so? But wait, isn't the dark hour pretty brutal though? Even for us, how could she last 10 days worth in there? That is true. And even if she is still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Whoops. Are you just gonna abandon her then? I mean, did they forget that they said that Fuka has... A persona? Like she's awakened to that? They completely forget about that? I have an idea. Let's try to enter Tartarus the same way Yamagishi did. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That'll be the quickest way. It's a good idea. Is that really gonna work? In all honesty, I can't say I fully agree with this. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. But... I'm not just going to stand here and do nothing. If there's a chance we can save her, I'd never forgive myself. If you guys aren't with me, then I'm going in on my own. <sighs> Senpai? All right. We know it's risky, but we also can't just leave her there. Right. And we won't know until we try. Guess we're sneaking into the school then. <laughs> in that case, I've got just the thing. You do? No answer. This is a problem. I can't get a hold of the chairman. Oh. Well, that's not a big deal, right? There is one issue. Without the chairman's help, I'm not sure how we can get inside the school. No need to worry. I've got it all set. <laughs> all set? Unexplosive? Uh, I got it. <laughs> all right. I'll let you handle this. There's no time to waste. Let's go. An actual explosive? Uh, no. Uh, all I did was... Unlock a door. Yeah. See? We got in no problem. Man, I'm a genius. Is there really something to brag about here? 
So you unlocked it earlier. Très bien. Oui, good job. We should find somewhere to get ourselves ready. Your classroom should work, right? I mean, theoretically. Uh, what? Trey Ben? Is that French or something? Why are they talking in different languages anyway? Culture? Can we turn on the lights? No. Aw, you scared? No, I'm not. <laughs> Stupid. Hey, that's uncalled for. Quiet. We need to get started. It's better for us if the lights are off. They cut the power at night anyway. Who cuts the power off to a building at night? Buck? I don't really like sneaking around. First, we have to find the key to the gym. It should be in either the faculty office or the janitor's room. You three check the faculty office. Akihiko and I will take the janitor's room. After that, we'll meet in the main hallway on the first floor. Understood? All right. So, we're searching the faculty office, huh? Hey, maybe we'll find some test questions. <laughs> maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. You're not planning to do something unethical under my supervision, are you? No. I suppose you'll need to be executed. Hey. Hey, come on! Obviously, I was joking! <laughs> All I meant by interesting was that there's a higher chance of finding the key there. Enough with the excuses. Let's head to the janitor's room. Iori, you're coming with us. All right, let's get this over with. Should head to the faculty office. All right. Why? You can you use a PC back in the dorm? Come on, let's get, get to the faculty office. <laughs> Sorry, just the way she said why, it's like, but, but why? 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 I don't know, it just makes me laugh. Uh, oh, class. maybe. You got something in the classroom? Sorry, you're gonna have to worry about that later. But I forgot something on my desk. It's right there. Student council mm -hmm. room. What's up? I don't think we have any business here. Mm. Classrooms are kind of kind of creepy at night. Um, let's get going, okay? Uh, I need to use the washroom. Seriously? Wait, really? At a time like this? Let's try to be quick, will you? I, I gotta, I gotta take a dump, man. Oh, I got the. What? Seriously, again? You're not doing this on purpose, are you? Fine, but hurry up. What? I got the runs. What can I say? All right, fine. Let's move on. something you what there's someone else here we yeah gotta hide. the rest of our crew security guard <sighs> it was just the security guard why would you need a security guard anyway you're freaking out no, I'm not. I'm just a little nervous, that's all. I mean, can you blame me? Everyone has something they're afraid of. This is a totally normal reaction. Well, now that I think about it, that could have just been someone else from our group, so hearing footsteps isn't a big deal. Maybe? Yeah. <laughs> There's nothing to be afraid of, right? <laughs> uh, why am I laughing? <laughs> M my phone! Why now? And of course, it's just spam. Who spams in the middle of the night? I mean, that would freak most people out, right? Come no. on, the thing just rang out of nowhere. That was so cute. Uh, what? That's not funny, you know.
All right. Ooh, can I buy some bread? Aw. How come? Well, you want to go that way? Come on, we should get up. We shouldn't get off track. What's that red light down there? It's maybe just like the emergency exit or something. Uh -uh. This usually isn't open. This side usually isn't open. We should enter from the other door. Oh, I'm getting the runs again. What? Anyway. Unbelievable. Hey, what exactly do you think you're doing? Stop screwing around. Library? The door is tightly it's sealed. Like that. I thought the key would be in the library. Let's check the faculty office. The door is tightly uh -uh. sealed. That's the nurse's office, not the faculty office. Come on, we don't have time to be wandering around. This is a perfect time to wander around. What are you talking about? Alright, fine. Doesn't seem to be anyone in the faculty office. Might be a good time to enter. Yeah, let's do it. No. No. It's so dark, I can barely read these. I love how we're students walking around in school in the middle of the night with our evokers, evokers that look exactly like guns. You know, it's just, it's just funny. What does it say on this one? Uh... <laughs> I'm so sick. What? Are you trying to scare me or something? You better watch out. What goes around comes around, buddy. This is so. This is totally this something is stuff to I would do. Gym key. Okay, let's go. We're supposed to meet up with everyone in the main hallway. Oh, they're already there. Did you find the key? Sure did. Sure did. You know, I heard a scream that sounded kind of familiar. <laughs> huh? Wait, you actually did? I was just kidding. You want to take this outside? Guys, come on. All right, we'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour begins, I'll pinpoint Yamagishi's position. I'm going in. You come too. You can take the lead as usual. Uh. All right. Uh, then I'll be the third. Wait a second, Yukatan. Remember how I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? Give me a chance to make up for that. Oh come on! It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. All right, Junpei, we'll give you another shot. And with that, the teams are set. All boys crew. Sweet. Thanks. What? What's wrong, Takeba? Do you have a problem staying with Mitsuru? Uh, no, no. It's fine. It's almost time. Let's go. How would this whole ordeal work with like daylight savings time? Like, would would it be like? Well, I guess the midnight hour is like it's at midnight, right? But would the next day would it be at like eleven p.m. or does it stay at twelve p.m.? You know what I mean? Actually, I don't even know if Japan has been daylight savings time. I'm not entirely sure. That's right. I guess I'm alone after all. Fuka. No. No, I don't want to hear this. Calling me. I... I have to go to school. Tell her I'm sorry. Fuka. I love how they're like, the safest place you could be is a dorm. But like, no one's looking after her. When this has been known to happen to the other the other students. Brilliant, isn't it? So 
We still haven't heard back from them. The transmission range is at max, too. I hope that girl Moriyama is okay at the dorm. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour. But we couldn't risk bringing her here. And having one of us stay behind to watch her wasn't an option either. Yeah, I guess so. Hmm. Well, we are all here for Yamagishi-san's sake. I'm here. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is everyone all right? I don't know. That's separate. Akihiko! Come in, Akihiko! Uh, is he out of range? That's worrying. Must have lost consciousness. I don't see Sonata or Junpei. Oh, hi. Are you awake? I don't know. Am I? I could be dreaming for all I know. This is the first time we've spoken outside of your room. Uh. Why are you here? I told you, remember? I'm always with you. But we don't have much time to talk. Tonight, there is more than one ordeal you must face. You should hurry. She's waiting for you. You guys will need her. See you. I hope we meet again. I'm sure we will. Communication has been lost. Lovely. Okay. So I guess we're on our own. For now. So let's see if we can try avoiding shadows. Who's there? I heard the girl. You imagine if it's the walls talking? <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna avoid the shadows. What's your current location? Reply immediately. Nah. Are you human? Are you? On the floor. Ah. I'll attack one of them. See how it goes. Oh. I'll go with. Never oh. mind. Let's rush. Oh. This shouldn't be any problem. It's over. Ooh, jack o' lantern. Let's release Jack Frost. So, okay. Shadows don't seem too hard at all. Ah! Take the experience right now. All 
Alright, do we clear this floor? With the exception of that one shadow, but that's fine. Uh, yeah, next floor. Where am I? Why am I here? Please, answer me. Um, if I could see you. The fact that we could take these guys on solo is like crazy. Uh, I'll take the money for here. money please this was less than the three money what the fuck that's bullshit all right i think i missed yeah i missed one down there is someone there yeah is me Mabufu. Please answer me. I have. No, no. Oh, man, that was so close. I'm actually glad I got the, the shoes and the armor as well. You know what sucks? I'm not seeing anything I can break. You know what's crazy? We don't even know what floor we're on. Oh, looks like they found each other at least. Hey, here he is. Man, we were worried about you. I'm glad you two are safe. I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again. Oh yeah. Did you hear a voice on your way here? Yeah. Surely like... did. Who's there? Are you human? That's it? That's the voice? Wait, didn't that come from behind us? Uh. Are you Fuka Yamagishi? Yes. Wow, you're alive! That's awesome! Never fear, the heroes are here. Good to see you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I... Don't worry, you're safe now. Y yes, I'll be fine. Sorry, I'm just so relieved. Looks like I made the right call then. I'll see if I can contact Mitsuru. What is this place? One second I was at school, and then... Uh, it's kind of a long story. We can explain after we get out of here. Mitsuru. Can you hear me? Mm, no good. All I hear is static. Oh, are you hurt anywhere? You've probably seen the monsters wandering around, right? So, there is something dangerous in here then. 
I've gotten by without them finding me so far. This whole time? Wow. Wait. You've avoided them this entire time? How is that possible? Um, it's hard to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. What do you mean? Are you saying you're psychic or something? She has the same power as Mitsuru, actually. She might be even stronger. Mitsuru's persona is always more combat-focused to begin with. Persona? Hang on to this. Huh? Wait, is this... is this a gun? Think of it as a lucky charm. It doesn't actually fire bullets. Um... okay... Alright, let's get out of here. Whoa, check out the moon! It's huge! I don't think I've ever seen it so bright. Last time. There's some research that indicates the shadows are affected by the phases of the moon. Although the same thing is true about humans. That would explain Yucatan's mood swings. Hey, wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail? Hmm? It was. Uh, is something wrong? Hey, did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked back in April? It was full. Today is June 8th. The monorail incident happened on May 9th. And the assault in the dorm was on April 9th. They were all on a full moon. Mitsuru, are you there? Uh, Eagle, shut those arms. Hey, can you hear me? Mitsuru, come in! Be careful. Mitsuru? Mitsuru! What is that? It's much bigger than the others. And it's attacking someone. Damn it! What the hell's going on? I'm totally lost here. It's one Girls are being attacked. My guess is right. They come every full moon. We've got to hurry. Hey! Wait for me! What? Oh, that's not good. There's two of them? Mitsuru! Takeba! <laughs> Sun. We gotta draw the shadows away. Yeah, I'm on it. Hey, if it's a fight you want, then you've got it. Akihiko, be careful. Normal attacks don't work on them. Hey! What the? Uh. I. Uka. No, what are you doing here? Moriyama-san? Hey! Come back! Please, get out of here! It's not safe! I... I had to tell you... I'm sorry... Hey! Look out! I have to protect her! Yamagishi san? A persona? I can see. I. I can see these monsters' weaknesses. 
That's helpful. Can it be? Just as I thought. Mitsuru, let her take your place. We'll handle these guys. All right, boss time. I'll begin searching for the monster's weaknesses. Please give me some time. I'll go with. Uh, I guess we'll try blue here. Nope. I'll give him hell. Okay. So those don't work. Oh, that worked. I'll take care of this. I've got you. Oh, that looked cool. It's done. I can start the analysis at any time. Please tell me when to activate it. Uh, now. <laughs> okay, so press that while on the analyze screen to use Ruka's skill. Full analysis. Doing so will deplete her SP. Oh, okay. Will deplete. Like, fully? Carrying out a full analysis will reveal the enemy's weakness. Use it to battle more effectively. Don't after a full analysis can only be done after everyone, both allies and enemies, has entered their turn on the first round. That's fine. Oh, just 35. That's heavy. I didn't know I had this kind of power. Your ability is just what we'd hoped for. It's even more accurate than Mitsuru's. <sighs> so what do you... So you are weak to gun. What to do? Never mind. Or so. Oh, we don't have the gun anymore. Fuck. That's the only thing they're weak to. That is uh, not good. Changing their affinity. The one. Uh, okay. Let's do that. Ice. Okay. I'll go with. Moi coming. What to do? Not that. Punch. I'll go with Moi Bash. Okay, good. I'm finally doing all out attack. Uh, we'll just do a regular attack, I guess. You're yeah. up, we got Come, persona. Yeah, baby. 
Then, oh, let's heal you up. Appreciate it. All right, oh. Hell yeah! You're done for. Yeah, buddy. Don't pull any buttons. Better get those people. That's fine. Um, you're lucky I don't have any. Uh, I'll go with. Ah, uh, let's go. heal him. Now, you die, motherfucker. Nice, Emperor and Empress. over. Luca, you... Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. Luca! Oh. It's all right. She's just exhausted. Luca, Luca, I... Where did those two shadows come from? Somewhere outside of Tartarus. Just like with the dorm and the monorail. Outside, huh? Uh, what are we gonna do about Moriyama-san? She knows about the Dark Hour and the shadows. It doesn't matter. She's not like us, so she won't remember anything that happens in the Dark Hour. The good news is, she didn't fall victim to the shadows despite hearing their call. So I don't think she'll get drawn in again. She's safe now. But doesn't that mean she'll forget Yamagishi-san saved her life? That doesn't seem right. Actually, I get the feeling that things will work out. I'm sorry, Fuka. I'm so sorry. It looks like she's learned her lesson. It was uneasy, but we managed to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. And it's actually, it's a good story. It's a good arc for Moriyama, you know, like uh, the bully is repenting her ways, right? His warning, oh, whoops, what did I miss? The mysterious boy appeared again. His warning doesn't seem to be just a dream. But I can't make any sense of it right now. I will feel way too exhausted. I should get back, I should get some rest as soon as I get back to the dorm. Yeah, Moriyama's arc, as I was saying, like it's the bully repenting her ways. It's it's a it's a good story. Good morning. Good morning. Yamagishi and Moriyama are recovering nicely. They'll be released from the hospital in the next few days. That's good to hear. Um, what'll happen now? Precisely. We need to invite Yamagishi to the dorm and explain what happened. Considering that power of hers, we could definitely use her help. Class has ended for today. Kenji, my man! Uh, 
Seems like Yamagashi, Yamagishi san is still asleep. I can't help but worry about her. Rightly so. Oh. Well, I've checked out all the new first year girls. They're all pretty cute, but the glass girl in the student council is pretty. It's especially cute, don't you think? It's alright. Chihiro? <sighs> you got a sec. I need to talk to you. Do you like I might grow closer? Let's do it. Sorry. What are we with him? I'm not really in the mood for Rama today. Let's just head to Wild Duck. I think we're rank 7 with him? I can't eat. <laughs> I'll eat it for you. What happened? Talk to me, boy. Sure you want to know? I don't think we're going to get to eat together like this anymore. To be honest, something's been on my mind. I saw a magazine in Emmy Reed's room. Guess what it was called? Cold living. Bride to be. How'd you guess? Man, you're amazing. When I saw that magazine, it got me thinking. And I've made up my mind, man. As soon as I graduate high school, I'm gonna marry Emmy Reed. You think Whoa. that's a good plan? Uh. You're rushing things. I'm gonna be a true bro and give it to him honest. I'm not rushing things. I'm gonna marry her eventually, so what's the difference? Why should I wait? I'm seriously in love with Emiri, and I'm gonna marry her. Then, Emiri Kana will be known as Emiri Tomochika, and I will make her the happiest wife ever. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I just want you to back me up, you know? Seems dead set on this plan. Uh -oh. Now we're rank seven. We should get going. I wonder how many more times I'll get to walk home with you like this. So, I mean, you still hang out even though you're married. Oh, welcome back. Thank you. Kirijo Senpai and Sanada san went to the hospital to pay Yamagishi a visit. I wonder if she's all right. So... I bet Kirijo Senpai and Sonata Senpai are trying to convince Yamagishi san to join our team. That worries me. Yeah. Kirijo Senpai and Sonata san are both at the hospital checking up on Yamagishi. You guys. Three times I've been told this now. That means no Tartarus tonight. Guess we gotta find something random to do to kill some time. Let's see what's on TV. You have to be prepared and carry an umbrella during the rainy season. The fight between those with umbrellas and driving wind is still being waged today. That concludes our special report. Next, the news. Followed by a look at everyone in recovery from apathy syndrome. Okay. Uh, I want to let it all out. What are we today, Tuesday? Uh, today's Tuesday's Courage. And actually... Someone wants to talk to me here? Can I talk to this guy now? Actually. Hmm. Uh, right here. Oh, my charm needs to be smooth, right? Uh, does she want to talk to me? Yes, she does. Good day. Uh, about requests. Are you accepting a request? Ooh, okay. Let's hear the results. Seems you have completed requests. This is the famous Umi Ushi beef bowl. The aroma truly wets the appetite. Very well then. Now then, bon appetit. Bon apple teeth. My, how delicious! Something this delectable must have cost a fortune. Oh my! It didn't. Then I must applaud this corporation's efforts to sell such quality food for cheap. Please take this as your reward. I will. Male uniforms. Uh, level 13 Wonderful. or above. Bufu Legend. Uh, greater persona with Kua. Oh my. Oh. 
Okay. You've already fulfilled the requirement. Your Sutra. Okay, fusion series. Emperor and Oberon. Have an Oberon with the skill Mazio in your possession and report to Elizabeth. Think of it. I've actually prepared a little assignment for you in which you have to fuse a persona. I do believe that the best way to, de uh, to deepen your understanding on a topic is with hands-on experience. It'll be a tad challenging, but do give it a By try. All means. Yeah, the problem with fusing personas is you need money. Like, a lot of money. Like, a lot of money. The, the problem is, it's like... The world you live in is so bright and colorful. Personas it's can be... It's rather blinding. Personas can be cheap, but like, you know, 2500 here, 3000 there, another 2000 there. That shit adds up. What are we at here? 252 and 74. Okay. Uh, no. Nothing else Very right now. Well. Uh, so I think we'll actually work today. Uh, work part time. It's pretty crowded. I have to work more efficiently than usual. Despite being busy, I responded to complaints about the slow service with sincerity. Gave you a little bonus on top of your usual pay. Thanks, man. I was thinking, do you think Kirijo Senpai saved Yamagishi san because it was the right thing to do? Yeah. Or was it just because she needed a persona user and we need her? Or is it because she's a persona user? I can't read today. I don't know what's going on with me. Um, she has good intentions. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Well, I guess it's really up to Yamagishi san whether she joins us or not. Sorry to bring this up out of the blue. Next topic. Are we up to the Kamakura era yet? I guess not. Oh man, we haven't even reached the Nara era. Well, let's just power through it real quick. First, the Taika reforms. They happened in the year 645. Just remember that and we can move on. Huh? What were they about? Oh, nothing major really. Later on in 710, there was a Heijo Kyo. Okay, that wraps up the Nara era. Feeling sleepy. No sleeping. What? You actually want more? Okay, here's a question for you then. What's the name of the anthology consisting of 4,500 4, poems, give or take, leading up to the Nara era? You know what? I don't feel like picking on anyone today. I'll just tell you. It's a man Yoshu. We're supposed to cover the Koken Wakashu too, but I don't really care. Ask Mr. Ikoda if you want. Ugh, I don't care about any of this. I just want to get to the Sengoku era. I can hear it calling for me. I force myself to stay awake. I'm smarter, guys. We should start focusing on academics a little bit again. Uh, just because exams are going to be coming up sooner than later. Okay, Maiko. Who's in Polonia? Oh, the chubby student, right? And this is... Yeah. Work-related. Hello! Oh, hi! What are we gonna play today? Well, she's in better spirits. I don't think our bond will grow. Um, that's fine. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Next time we can... Hey, what do you want to do? I 
As, have your parents noticed you've run away yet? All right, we got the perfume and the health supplement. Welcome back. What's up, dude? Kirijo Senpai and Sonata Sun are both visiting Amagishi today, too. That leaves us on standby at the dorm. I wonder if she'll come home soon. Fuka-chan. Hey, listen. She hasn't agreed to join, though, right? I hope she's not being pressured by them or anything. Hey, so... I hope Kirijo Senpai and Sonata Senpai aren't pressuring her to join us if she doesn't want to. Sometimes it feels like they'd do anything to achieve our goal, you know? Hell yeah! Finally, a new addition to this dorm. Oh man, I'm so stoked. Maybe I should clean my room. Not a bad idea. So Wednesday is academics. You know what? I think we'll do I think we'll do the arcade today. It's a message from Sonata. Sorry for the short notice. Yamagishi is being released from the hospital today. We all need to talk to her together. Come to the command room once you get back to the dorm. Um, I just realized I haven't saved in a, oh, I haven't saved at all yet. Yamagishi san is leaving the hospital soon. Isn't that great? Alright, all right, Kenji. Dude, this isn't good. I. Let's do it. Thanks. Let's go somewhere talking private. Hey, man. Sorry to make you come here. I, uh, uh, damn it. Are you in trouble? Yeah. I, I. Dude, it's bad. I don't know what to do. The school found out about Emiri and me, it blew up and became this huge thing. You mean students and teachers are not allowed to date? I'm shocked. Frankly, I I'm shocked. Society, man. Why why did they have to label everything? Why does everything need to have a label on it? Why can't two people just be happy? It's sad. Tragic, really. Just tragic. And now she's being transferred to a school in Kyushu. What do I do? You two should talk it out. Yeah, man, that's what I thought. Except I feel like she's totally avoiding me. It's like all of a sudden she won't answer my calls or reply to my texts. She's probably only doing this to protect me, but still. I can't just sit here and do nothing. I gotta think of a plan, and I'm gonna need your help. Machiko opened up to me about his troubles. Great, we're gonna have another fucking runaway on our hands. Just drama, 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 man. I'll see you soon. Thanks for hearing me out today. Mm hmm. Yeah, no problem. What are friends for? So, you're Fukuyama Gishikun, right? Y yes <laughs> Relax, there's no need to be nervous. Go on and have a seat. Uh, okay. I just want to quickly mention that everyone did an excellent job uncovering the truth. Ah, and one other thing to report. 
I've heard that all three girls have regained consciousness. That's good news. That's great news. From what I understand, they each came to the school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. Then, once the dark hour began, they were attacked by shadows near the gate. Because of the situation's similarities to an old ghost story, rumors naturally spread quickly. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. It's all my fault. What? Where'd you get that from? You were the victim in all this. But all of those rumors started because I was absent for so long. That's totally not your fault. I don't think we could have won that fight if you hadn't been there. You saved our lives. That's not something just anyone could have done. Take pride in that. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. And right now, our group absolutely needs your abilities. Can we count on you to help us? Are you asking me to join you? That's right. Yuricho Senpai. Only if you want to. <sighs> I think you'd make a good addition to the team, too. Sonata Senpai. You know we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it. I'll do it. It would be my honor. What? Are you sure? If you do join, you'll have to move into the dorm. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. Thank you. We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Okay. Thank you. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Um, it's okay. Really. One other topic I'd like to discuss is those special shadows. We had another encounter this month. While we still don't know where they're coming from, I do believe Sonata-kun is right. They seem to appear alongside the full moon. This, at least, will help us plan for the future. So, the next full moon is showtime, huh? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Knowing Seems when like. to expect them is a big advantage for us. Now, on the day of the fight, we'll be ready to get in the ring. <sighs> Figured out the pattern for when sh uh, special shadows appear. Is this what the mysterious boy was trying to tell me? I should start paying attention to the moon's phases. All right. Hmm. Dude, she's the exact opposite of Yukatan. Smart, kind, modest. Hey, Makoto, what do you think of her? Uh... That all you think about. Wait, what? Dude, you need to lighten up. Keep up the attitude and you'll be wasting your youth. Oh, that's right. Kirijo kun and Sanada kun left to walk Yamagishi kun home. It's late after all. Still, today was a great day for us all. We've gained new power and learned more about shadows. We're entering the next phase of our battle. We could we can't just sit on our hands either. I'd say we could use a new trick up our sleeves. They're not wrong. I know she technically made the decision on her own, but it didn't seem like Yamagishi-san was really given much of a choice to me. I don't like this. Oh, you, you worry way too much. Okay. Um, what are we? Thursday is charm. You know what? Let's try the, the wild duck challenge again. Too crowded, fuck. Um, no. This is the one that makes you smarter. Check what can be done. Sure. Let's see how much it raises academics. Regular customers are ordering the seafood full course. Seems like a special offer for regulars on Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Sunday. 
me write this down. On Thursday, Friday, and Sunday. Maybe if my charm was at least confident, I'd be a memorable enough customer to be able to order it. Okay. <laughs> I wonder what's in this food. I feel like my mind is clearer than usual. Two for 680 yen? Hell of a lot cheaper than the, than the arcade. Morning. Morning. Hey, Yuki-kun, what do you think of Yamagishi-san? Uh, she's very helpful. Huh? That's all you have to say? What do you want me to say? I mean, yeah, her persona ability is pretty amazing, but doesn't it seem like she wasn't really given a choice in joining the team? I hope she'll be okay. Again, you're thinking too much into it, man. Girl can easily say no. Hey, did you hear? Apparently, Mr. Okoda's in hot water. Really? What'd he do? I don't know, but I think it's serious. Sexual harassment, maybe? <laughs> I can totally see that. Um, good morning. <sighs> hey, look! It's the ghost girl! Quiet, she can hear you! Oh, Buka, you're here. Moriyama-san? I heard you started living in the dorms. Yes. You're looking glum today, as usual. Well, if you got something on your mind, you can always talk to me. You could probably use a friend, huh? Moriyama-san. That's nice of her. Come on, you don't gotta be so stiff. Just call me Natsuki. <gasps> Thank you. Class is ended for today. Hey! Koda was Fuka's homeroom teacher, right? I saw him just now, and man, he looked like his world was gonna end. This is what Kirijo Senpai meant? She did tell him I'll make sure to deal with you later. Yeah, you don't fuck with her. It must suck to be a bully. You have to pretend to be nice so no one gets suspicious. And if someone finds out, you'd have to be even nicer to them. I'm glad there won't be a full moon for a while, but still, can't help thinking about it. Alright, Kenji. If we got time, can we talk? I always got time for you, Tomochika. Ramen's on me. Fuck yeah, man. You're good with ramen, right? Yeah, let's do ramen. Hey, man. I was gonna wait to tell you this until we sit down to eat, but I've decided to go to Kyushu with Emiri, so this will be the last time we have ramen together. Emiri? Who's that she's with? I didn't think he'd get so serious about it. He's just a kid. He must have misunderstood. I did it for my own track record as a teacher. He should be grateful. Seems like he's the one who spread the rumors, and now other students are. Just a little longer. We'll celebrate our wedding soon enough. I can't wait. Emiri. So, I guess today was the day she was leaving. I had no idea. I was so excited about going with her that I... I... So wait, she Miss Kano was getting married, and she was shacking up with a with a fucking student. Cheer up, man. S stop it! Why are you trying to make me feel better? You should be laughing at me. I should. Oh, such an idiot! Such a stupid, stupid idiot! 
I should have known this would happen. It was so obvious she wasn't serious about me. Why, Emmy Reed? Why? <laughs> now my nose is running. <laughs> Thanks. Looks like a blur. The blur witch. You are here. He's trying to tough out the pain. He's like our relationship is stronger. Let's go home. Oh, Kenji, Kenji, Kenji. Welcome back. Oh yeah, I hear Fuka's moving to one of the rooms on the third floor. But the girls put their foot down on when I offered to help. Said us guys aren't allowed. Anyways, looks like she'll be coming here pretty early tomorrow. Exciting stuff, huh? Right? The girl said no guys allowed, but what if they need help uh, carrying the heavier stuff? Well, I guess they call us for they call for us if they really need the help. Hmm? What is it? If you're looking for Mitsuru and Takuba, they're on the third floor. It sounds like they're getting ready for Yamagishi's room ready. It sounds like they're getting Yamagishi's room ready, so I doubt we'd be of much use. Unless, like, they find a cockroach or something. No. You'd be surprised, actually. Going into the rainy season, we've got an unusual clip to show. What you're seeing is a prototype of an artificial rain generator. For a country like this where water is becoming scarce. Uh, third floor. Hi. <sighs> the room must be covered in dust since no one's used it before. Don't let there... Please don't let there be any cockroaches. I'm sorry. I apologize for not being able to go to Tartarus multiple days in a row. Preparing for Yamagishi's move has taken longer than I anticipated. Never mind that. In any case, this floor is reserved for the girls' room. Males are not permitted. Please return downstairs. No, oh, you're not gonna let me... Uh, okay. Let's save... All right, I'm actually gonna call it here for uh, for today's episode. Uh, got a lot of stuff done. We got a new member. We took care of another boss, and are gonna pretty much start heading into exam territory sooner than later. So we gotta brush up on our academics. Kenji, Kenji, Kenji. What are we gonna do with him? Looks like maybe one or two more hangout sessions with a guy, and we'll complete his social link as well. Hope you guys are enjoying uh, everything so far, the the story. Uh, we've still got a long way to go. We're not even like a quarter of the way through. So, yeah. I really appreciate you guys, uh, you know, sticking along with me for this. But thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.